A private jet worth $70 million, a diamond-encrusted watch worth $1.85 million, and a Bugatti scented ISI. Here are some of the most outrageously costly items Cristiano has purchased with his big contracts. Cristiano Ronaldo is, without a doubt, one of the world's highest paid athletes. CR7 amasses fortunes both on and off the pitch. Welcome back to another exciting video from Super Info Hive. Today's video is about things Ronaldo owns that cost more than your life. Before we start the video, please like, subscribe, and press the bell icon. And he can purchase nearly whatever he wants with all that money in the bank. The first is a $800,000 buy that practically broke the global record. Everyone knows Ronaldo adores luxury items, and he owns some of the most costly watches in the world, including a very expensive Rolex, while accepting the Player of the Century Award at the Dubai Globe Soccer Awards. Ronaldo showed off the gorgeous watch to admirers, and it truly is a work of art. To obtain the Rolex GMT Master Ice, you must have around 380,000 euros in your bank account. This model is the most costly Rolex in the world, made of 18 karat white gold and studded with hundreds of 30 karat diamonds. It's so gleaming that you can see it from a mile away. This was apparently insufficient for CR7 because the following item on this list is even more pricey than the Rolex. In 2018, Ronaldo attended a news conference to announce his emotional return to Champions League competition and he displayed the Frank Muller watch that cost him a jaw-dropping one. 2 million euros. Why is it so expensive? The stunning item features 424 gleaming white diamonds. That's correct. This watch is more valuable than most people's homes. But, hey, if you're going to score goals left and right, you might as well score some diamonds, huh? However, Ronaldo is no stranger to this. He was spotted wearing a Jacob Company valued at 100,000 euros and weighing 15.25 carats. But when Ronaldo wanted to inform his girlfriend Georgina that he loved her, he pulled out a 615,000 euro engagement ring. The ring is studded with diamonds and a big sapphire stone. Ronaldo smashed yet another record when he presented his girlfriend with the most costly engagement ring in football. This man can't seem to stop setting records. Ronaldo simply had to flex a little after winning his second consecutive Italian series title in 2020. A boat worth $12 million. The yacht is very close to a residence on the ocean. But when you make nearly $2,000 per hour, you can afford to live like this. There are five cabins, a dining room, six bathrooms, and a kitchen on board. There's even a full-size gym on the yacht for when Ronaldo needs a quick pump. It's no surprise that Ronaldo and his family take so many vacations. But that's only one of Ronaldo's automobiles. What Ronaldo spends on vehicles and aircraft will astound you. Ronaldo, on the other hand, does not exclusively spend on his partner. She also gives him pricey gifts. What do you get your guy when he already has everything? Georgina, on the other hand, receives a huge, gift-wrapped Mercedes-Benz G-Class. The stunning former store assistant ensured CR7 had the best 35th birthday ever by buying him the amazing Mercedes G-Wagon Brabus, which she paid up to 600,000 euros for. And the fantastic SUV has a top speed of 137 kilometers per hour. It is natural for Cristiano Ronaldo to acquire a fleet of expensive cars as the world's richest footballer. Ronaldo owns more than 20 luxury cars, which is more than Lionel Messi. Bugatti, on the other hand, is a brand that CR7 adores. The Portuguese supermodel owns Lamborghinis, Ferraris, and Rolls Royce. In an interview with Piers Morgan, he admitted that he wants to have two of everything. He went for three this time. The Bugatti Trio is, without a doubt, one of the most costly automobiles in his garage. Bugatti Chiron, Bugatti Scented ISI, and Bugatti Veyron are all examples of supercars. The most expensive is the Bugatti Scented ISI. Ronaldo paid a stunning $9.9 .9 million for the Chiron, which costs $2.15 million, and the Veyron, which costs $1.7 million. Just because a Bugatti Veyron will not satisfy CR7's desire for fast cars. In the same year, he purchased the Lamborghini Aventador, which was manufactured in 2011. 
Despite its exorbitant price, it is the most celebrated model by the Italian automobile designer and is owned by footballers all over the world. Ronaldo announced the acquisition on Instagram in 2016 with the message Bom dia, good morning. That brings his car collection to over 17 million pounds. But Ronaldo isn't finished. Ronaldo bought a Cullinan to his collection in 2020 after previously owning a Rolls-Royce Phantom for roughly 363,000 euros. He also customized the interior with black and white leather to show his devotion to his new company. The Cullinan is 5 meters long and has a V12 engine with 571 horsepower. But a global superstar like Cristiano cannot be bothered with the trouble of commercial flights. That is why Ronaldo's private jet is next on the list. I understand what you're thinking. Oh, another celebrity with a private jet. How inventive. But wait, this isn't any ordinary private jet. This is a Gulfstream G650, the most expensive private jet available. It's like having your own little sky shopping center. Do you want to buy a new car? Simply fly it to the dealership. Do you want to own an island? No worries, simply jet it to the Caribbean. If you wanted to, you could even fly to the moon. Maybe not the moon, but you get the idea. Ronaldo is obviously a huge spender when it comes to vehicles and jets. His rides cost him millions of dollars. But what Ronaldo spends on his homes is really ridiculous. Real estate is one of Ronaldo's most valuable belongings, and every home he's lived in since going pro has seemed like a palace. Ronaldo's most incredible villa is on his home island of Madeira. He purchased a decrepit factory in 2015 and spent over $10 million transforming it into a seven-story luxury mansion in under four years. His mother generally occupies the house, and his older brother, Hugo, and Ronaldo and his family relocated here during the COVID-19 pandemic quarantine period in 2020. The structure is situated in one of Madeira's most stunning locations, just over the enormous Atlantic Ocean. The precise amount of bedrooms on the property is still being determined. It does, however, have a rooftop swimming pool, a five-car garage, an Olympic-sized pool, and a tiny football pitch. There's also a jacuzzi where Ronaldo unwinds while he's at home. A burglar, however, broke into the house through the garage and stole the San Juventus jersey as well as other little items. Thanks for watching the video. If you enjoyed it, please like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more exciting content.